Hey guys, hope you're all doing well. Welcome back. Let's play some more EU4 Ulmayed Caliphate. And I know, I know this has been super boring for the last couple of months, uh, or the last couple of days, I mean. Um, unfortunately, this has just been the tail of the tape. We've been having a lot of issues with our finances. And uh, so, you know, live and learn, I suppose. Let's go ahead and break off your alliances, though. Uh, that's fine. All his money. And when it's all said and done, we come out with an extra loan out of the bank. We can do that. And some luck in Separatist is fine. I will actually go ahead and put the money into... Oh, I didn't take his trade. I should have taken his trade. But that's fine. Uh, let's go ahead and just suppress the rebels there. And we are waiting until we have about 550, 600, 550, probably. That way we can double up. Global trade is here though, so it's unfortunately going to be affecting us in negative, but it's all good. We are going to be able to attack very, very soon. We will be able to attack Spain. France would join us. It's gonna be a big war, man trying to think of like what I would be doing I think I'd probably be down on the African front while France is taking them on up here but France would be fighting on two fronts so that's also kind of not ideal but uh, I'm not sure absolutism is right around the corner so we'll be able to do both of them which would be wonderful let's just wait until 600 apparently and uh, let's go ahead and uh, not have you very good. I don't want stability cost. I want like uh, probably no oh, missionary strength is fine. That's fine. Let's go ahead and do that one. Anything that's gonna give us better. Um, ooh, Bohemia getting thick over here with his coalition as well. Um, I guess we're gonna lose some mill points. Okay. Hopefully he dies somewhat soon, actually. Kinda don't wanna have to deal with it anymore. Okay. Attacking Spain is going to be my next major thing. I would like to get some claims, so I'm gonna get some more claims. Um, you don't need them, but it makes it cheaper to core, so it saves you admin points, so it's worth. I'm just waiting, man. Waiting, waiting, waiting. Though absolutism, you know, once absolutism rolls around, it's gonna be fine, because we'll be able to really start expanding. Um, I know that it's definitely not ideal, you know, how slow it's been to expand, but, uh, it's all about that debt. It's, um, unfortunately, um, just what happens on my channel with, uh, when I, let's see here, can I make some money off of you? I totally could. Totally. Give me that money, baby. I'm not actually gonna do anything, so it's fine. I'll go ahead and I'll just drill him. Which one is, uh, told There you go. So we got these guys down here. So I'll actually have to just turn my maintenance on. Yeah, see, I'd rather you didn't get the siege, which you're going to, but it is what it is. Okay, so yeah, we're gonna wait till we get 600. And we'll take them both at the same time. Yearly inflation guy half off, sounds good. We're behind on the admin, so it's fine with me. So let's do another one. Let's do these two over here. One more month. Let's take two techs. Let's go ahead and go with a uh, number of states. Yes, sounds good to me. And uh, go ahead and have you guys drill and have you guys drill. Oh, they're already drilling? No, they were not. That's fine. So the reason why I'm doing that is, I'm sorry if you guys can hear the siren, 
the reason why we're doing that is he's being rented out. Uh, he's at war with somebody like on the other side of the world. I do not care at all about his war. Um, I just wanted the money, so that was the major thing. Um, I really don't want more inflation. We already have a bunch, so I lose the stab, unfortunately. Ottomans have declared war on Austria again. Warned by the Ottomans, huh? Hmm. Those Ottomans are looking pretty juicy. So, basically all you gotta do is you just need to cancel here, um... Oh, actually... I think if I kill his rebels for him, it will actually count for me? Let's see here. Oh, let me kill the rebels. Pretty sure if I lose any men, I might be wrong. I might, I'm probably wrong actually, but let's see here. Are they happy with me again? Nah, sadly. I just have to revoke my Kandadiari. At the very beginning of the month. There we go. And now they can't tell anybody that they're disappointed with me. So these guys are in a war. It would be ideal if Portugal would be like sending their men over that way, or Spain for that matter. Realistically, they probably are. It's Spain, so. Um, France would join. So I wonder, it would probably be best for me to keep my guys in here and then just try to sneak my men down. Or honestly, just give this front up. I should probably make sure that that's a higher level fort though. Um, Cause it is mountains as well, unfortunately. So let's go ahead and turn our army maintenance down. Let's actually just get all the mercs out. There's no mercs in that army. All right, cool. So let's get you guys up here. Um, we're going to declare on Spain eventually. Uh, though maybe declaring just on Portugal would be better. Cause then I could piece Spain out and have him annul his alliances, and we don't have to worry about France fighting on two fronts. And that would allow us to take some land down in here. Um, I'm not exactly sure how far over the Umayyad Caliphate was in this way, but uh, more than likely I'm just going to take all of this and then all of Iberia. I know that it, some people say they had some of Iberia, some people say they had all of Iberia, because of like the, uh, the Duchy of Asturias and all that stuff, but we'll come up to, at least to up here. And then um, we'll start setting our sights. Looks like Naples got eated, which is kind of funny, but uh, it is what it is. So we can totally have more men in the in the field if we wanted. Um, I, we just need more money. That's the issue. Uh, it's not that we don't have money. It's that we have a lot of debt. Um, so let's go ahead and actually turn maintenance on. Let's go ahead and just have you guys hang out over here because if Spain joins in, we could actually just go up there and stack wipe that eight that eight K stack right there, like right then and there. Let's see what's going on with tech. So sixteen, okay. We might actually be able to get a ah eh, cap shock doesn't matter. All right, so what's going on with you guys? I'm gonna go ahead and attack. Not right now. Hmm. Would like Timbuktu to join. It'd be a show superiority war. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's a 10k. I thought it said 40. I got scared. Um, very good. So look at that. Sunni tentacle heading up in there. Um... Let's wait till we get tech and then we will buy down the inflation or the corruption, I mean. Where are those Portuguese guys at even? What are you guys doing over there? That doesn't make much sense. Bavaria has a coalition that's forming. Or Bohemia, not Bavaria. So let's actually go ahead and get some men in this army. So let's go ahead and go with like 19 more. Or 19, let's go up to like 25 and have you guys go up to like 25. It's actually the perfect amount, so that's funny. 
quarantining the province is probably the right way to do it. New tariff. It's fine. Get some money from the merchant guilds. Yeah, that's fine. And then we'll just take some provinces away because they've been mad for the whole game anyways. Um, so this will make them go down. Oh, they weren't disloyal anyways. Oh, perfect. They'll, they won't even hardly be disloyal. Oh, cool. So, radical reforms. Can't have them kicked out if you don't have them in your court. So, it's always a wonderful thing. And there we go. Got free points for that. Wait a couple more months. Well, I guess we could take that right now. Couple months, we'll be able to get that one. Then we'll be really rolling in the dough. Legalism, it's fine. Just want to take tech before we uh, do the thing. Let's go ahead and pay off some debt. There we go. We're almost down to a thousand debt. It's crazy. All right, cool. So we have 30,000 men here. Who are you at war with? So they are at war with Portugal for some reason. Let's go ahead and holy war. France, you will be called in. And let's go ahead and make our guy a guy as well. They're so bad. It's literally so bad. So let's go ahead and see if we can get a jump on this eight stack here. Very good. Should be a stack wipe. I'm very surprised if it is not. Um, this is my light fleet. I'm going to go ahead and have you guys just not do that. Um, we'll just go ahead and have our guys hang out like that. And uh, we'll just have this 30 stack just chilling here, just waiting. Um, basically a backup stack. Uh, so the major thing we're looking for in this war is we are going to cripple Spain. That, that's the main thing. We want to cripple Spain. We want to annul his alliances with every, with the Great Britain and Netherlands. Especially those two. Portugal, maybe. but And then maybe take some money from them as well. That would be good. But um, those are the major things we're looking for in this war. So Spain is definitely marching in. Um, yeah, that's not worth backing up. So, yeah. We're just going to chill over here. <laughs> I don't know where the French army went. They are disappeared, which is definitely not good. But think of it this way. Oh, crap. Um, yeah, these guys are going to get stack wiped. <laughs> so annoying. We might be able to sneak our guys down there. Um, this fort isn't done being built yet, which is really sad. It might be built here before they can actually get onto it. We'll see. Let's go ahead and turn on defensiveness over here. You have prosperity down there, really? Just in this one province, that's funny. You have prosperity in this one province as well. Cool, so, I mean, I can totally just keep killing the French smaller stacks that poke through. Let's make sure that our morale is comparable. It is. Um, fine, sounds good. They have a poopy general, we have a poopy general. Let's switch over to a slightly less poopy general. Get them killed out over here. Very good. They lost more than we did. Let's get you guys somewhere where you don't take a ton of attrition. The sooner we win this one over here, the better. Mostly we're just looking to get lots of war score with Spain. For some reason it says I have five with Portugal and none with Spain. That does not make sense, but that's fine. Let's actually get you guys over here and ready to defend them. All right, so they got on it, but did it? They finished the fort. They did. Good. Unfortunately, Portugal can get there, even though there's a fort here. So that doesn't really make much sense to me, but that's fine. It's it's really whatever, honestly. 
Now once we take Roussillon, we just have to take uh, Valencia and we're into the heartland of Spain. He has rebels that have just popped up and are fighting me. And they got an offensive role, which is hilarious. Okay, we st still didn't win it, even though we totally should have. They have lots of men over here. Somehow they still have... What? Oh, they have offensive. I was about to say, there's no way you guys have that good of siege rolls. Come on now, there we go. Let's go ahead and kill his rebels. That way we can occupy it ourselves and then do all that stuff there. We're not going to be able to get these guys over to uh, Africa, unfortunately. But it shouldn't be an issue. Uh, looks like he's full occupied by the Ottomans, which is very funny. <laughs> Uh, and so Spain is going to get a decent amount of war exhaustion from this, definitely. Because I assume this is all stated up for him. All of it is. Very good. And so this stack right here, I suppose we can get them over there. I just need to make sure that they're not landing men over here. That's the major thing. Um, yeah, totally. Repay alone. Come on now. Win the siege. Win it. Oh, we're taking attrition over here. I didn't even realize it. They didn't win it. Let's go ahead and take you guys, pull you down there. Uh, do they have a siege guy? They do have a siege guy. Very good. So, win. There we go. Let's get on down there. The more that we can beat up on Spain, the better when, when with all of this stuff. Very good. There we go. Cool. I'm gonna just go ahead and spend the points on it. I don't think they're gonna be able to win that from us. Because we can totally just reinforce before they can. So we have a plutocratic coup again, because we always do. So dumb. <laughs> so Spain, March men, Up there did anybody see how that happened because on my screen it certainly looks like they are just cheating and walking past forts again I could be wrong though I've definitely been wrong before regardless this is all wood so so lose a stab or gain corruption Go ahead and um, it's fine. Whatever. Oh, I don't want to lose another stab though. Need to win Valencia. Okay, we can actually get some points. So let's do that. Um, let's do that, that, and that. That will allow us to do that, which will allow us to get him on there, which is good. Let's come on over here. Somehow I can walk through that fort, which literally does not make sense. Like, that is not correct, but that's fine. Since they cheated, I'm going to cheat. So that's fine. They will not be able to back him up, so I'm going to have very superior numbers running in there. They're force marching, so they actually might be able to reinforce. Ah, uh, they changed their mind. They definitely changed their mind. Let's get on up there to uh, this Hoi Pito, or however that's pronounced. Catch him out there in the in the uh, woods. Wonderful. Should be a pretty convincing win. Go ahead and actually get you guys over there. So Spain really needs to just be destroyed. That's what we're looking for. Okay, they're actually heading down into that port over there. Oh, no. Um, how are you? Bro, how? Mm, dang it, man. Yeah, those cannons are dead. Very sad. Just lost five cannons. Let's go ahead. We have the money. Let's just go ahead and buy them. 
go ahead and make a few extra. Okay, so let's see what's going on with Spain. How you guys feeling? How you living? So they want out. They will break their alliance. They don't want. <laughs> they don't want out. Apparently. Um. So Portugal has low morale. Definitely. So I could totally just beat up on Portugal's morale. Spain, not so much. But um, if they wouldn't be backing them up, it should be an easy fight. Now, I just need to be careful about what where you guys are going. What? How did they win that so fast? That's so bogus. I don't believe that for literally a second. Absolutism is here. I don't believe that for a second that they won that. They must have um, rushed it. There's no possible ex explanation otherwise. Um, okay. Get these guys all grouped up. We're going to win this this month. Okay, apparently we're just going to have that happen. Let's come on up here. Kill off the smaller stacks. Come on up here into the Perineos. You guys can attack me, that's fine. Okay. We need to get our cannons grouped up. So this is hills. So I definitely want to uh, get down there. Ideally they don't back them up there. It looks like they're probably going to. Sadly. A hundred thousand men, by the way. Let's go ahead and pull you guys back. We lost more than them for reasons. Spain has low enthusiasm now, so he will actually peace out. And, um... Hmm. I don't care if he's still friends with Portugal. I'll take his money instead. But that's big. That breaks all of his alliances with these guys, so... In the next war, we can just attack him directly, and it'll be way better than the previous ones. So, um, we're not black flagged, wonderfully enough. And so we can actually just march our guys right on over. Siege down Lisboa. And uh, we definitely need to get down there, and I don't think we're going to be able to, unfortunately. That's kind of... Awkward. Let's go ahead and uh, just click the button and do that. And uh, pay off some more debt. We have no more loans, guys. We have no more. No mas if you're Spanish. That's wonderful. Very good. Now we just need to siege down Portugal. Mm-hmm. I would actually like to get a, like a foothold over here. Yeah, Gibraltar I can probably actually take easily enough. Um, let's go with the discipline guy, it's fine. There we go. Just need to take his capital and we'll be good. I don't think he's got an army anywhere. Oh, that's not true. He's got a huge army somewhere, but I don't know where they are. Somehow we gained those forts back. Oh, his army is literally just sitting right there. That's awesome. France is still just chilling in this war, man. Just need to take Lisboa and we can peace out. Lisboa. Come on. There we go. We could take Algarve. Oh, we could take all that. Wonderful. Portugal would hate me. But that's fine. Wonderful. That's a lot of really good cores for us, friends. Evora is in inland, so they're not going to be able to uh, do anything about that one. But that's fine. So let's go ahead and have half of you guys brought down here. And let's have you brought back home, because Austrian separatists are going to fire. And then, um... Not bad. I'll take that. I will definitely take that. Uh, we can... We have no more debt. 
Hey. Let's go ahead and spend some money making sure we're not losing money. How's that sound? Let's also make sure we have some more um, more transports. We just need more money, and then we can do that. All right, cool. Well, we finally have a foothold in Ol uh, Olm in uh, Iberia, which is wonderful. Um, yeah, those separatists fired, unfortunately. It, oh, they got a disease outbreak. Lucky for me. So I think we're just going to go in with the 20k. Let's go ahead and go in with our good general. All right, guys. So that is going to do it for this one. We uh, That was a big, big deal, breaking up Spain's alliances. That's a huge deal, actually, um, because it, it's going to make him a lot more vulnerable whenever we want to attack him in the future. So that's a big one. Hope you guys enjoyed. I know I certainly did. It feels good to be out of debt. I'll tell you that much. It feels very good to be out of debt now. Um, let's go ahead and uh, get some claims on you. We lost a bunch of them before. So uh, I think the next episode, we might end up taking on the Mamluks again. We'll see. We will see. Um, basically, we need to wait until the Ottomans are attacking him. Ooh, Persia would be a nice ally. Let's go ahead and improve with them. Uh, don't forget to subscribe if you guys haven't and you'd like to see more EU4 content in the future. And if you want to check out the Discord or support what we're doing on our Patreon page, uh, the Patreon support is huge, and it is, like, super, super, super influential in, like, just shaping how much I'm able to put time into this. So, the Patreon support is huge, and I appreciate you guys. Links for those are all in the description below the video. And with all that being said, this is Chewy Shoot, and I'll catch you guys later. A big special thanks to my top supporters on Patreon, Bloodbound92 and Palmer, as well as Jaren Clampett, Lambda Driver, Corbett Gaming, Michael Walker, Gregory the Bitter Steel, Jonathan Crane, Airborne Animal 7, as well as the rest of you guys. I appreciate all you so much. If you want to check out a couple of my other series I have going on, those are going to be linked on the left and right, and don't forget to subscribe.